Okay, you can see uh, I've put a square, uh, there's a meter square, the mats on the floor there. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna draw a cross on the floor uh, to create four boxes. So it's very simple to do. I'll do this now, uh, and as you can see, there we go. Using a piece of chalk, okay, or I don't know, you might be able to scratch the stone onto a slab in your back garden or onto the drive, okay. What we're going to do is create that square, okay, so we've got four boxes, all right. Now, all I'm going to do now is I'm just going to get into my stance, okay, and we're going, okay, so if we go for a traditional kind of boxing stance, okay, so you can see one foot, one side of the line, the heel, the other side of the line, so there's a little bit of a gap in between my feet there, okay? All right, now boxing-wise, my feet will face towards one o'clock, okay? There'll be more weight in my back leg, okay? As I'm sat in my stance, okay? I'll be weight over the back leg, 60%, 40 in the front. Okay, I'm bladed, okay? But you can see my feet at the moment. That's what you wanna try and be with your feet, okay? So you can use that line as a guide to start you off for your stance so if you're standing in this position here like that whether you're boxing yeah, so you can move forward and move back okay you've got a guide so you know right and feet either side of the line so i'm not narrow and i'm not going to fall over okay what we can do from there once we get ourselves into this position okay we can move ourselves back out of the square now i can use that square i can practice taking my front foot bringing my back foot backwards and forwards, okay? Doing it slowly, especially if we're a beginner and we don't come down to the boxing for a couple of, you know, for a week or so or whatever like that and we're not too sure of what we're doing with our feet, we can use this guideline and then we can just practice moving front foot, back foot, front foot, back foot, okay? We will, I'll move the, uh, I'll move the, uh, the camera in a second and we'll do it from the side and I'll get myself into full view so you can see. But we can use this box, okay? We can use this box now for practicing footwork, okay? Whether we're doing kickboxing or boxing, we can move into these things. So we can move backwards and forwards over these, uh, over these lines into different boxes. As I say, once you start to get working and you start working well with moving in and around these boxes, okay, then we can add some hand work and we can add some, uh, some, you know, some punching and some kicking. You know, so add our hands and feet in the way of being a bit more offensive or being defensive, okay? So we'll look at that next. 